So, Chain Bear um, released a bunch of um, predictions for the 2018 season of Formula 1 and I just had to respond. But before I do that, I'll just uh, wrap up his predictions. Kimi retires at the end of 2018. Four different teams will win races. Honda Toro Rosso will finish some decent races but will have embarrassing engine failures in others. 15 cars will get engine penalties. Disliked McLaren livery. Red Bull unique livery. Accident causes halo controversy. Indy adopts shield but Formula 1 rejects it. Super hard declared available for one race and one only. Liberty Media overreact to the backlash over Grid Girls. 2021 rules include MGUH. Bottas P4 on Drivers' Championship. Beaten by Hamilton, Vettel and Red Bull. Red Bull sign Alonso and Honda. New aerodynamic rules on ground effect. Alonso wins 24 hours of Le Mans. Liberty Media introduces pre-race show. Silverstone not having Grand Prix after 2019. Only one new race winner, Esteban Ocon. Vettel outscores Kimi Raikkonen 2 to 1 or more. Someone will have a race ban. Red Bull second on Drivers and Constructors Championship. Williams seventh and a nonsense red flag. Now, I will respond by making my own predictions. Someone will come out as gay. Hopefully someone attractive like Stephen Ocon. Alonso will make some reference to his resting picture from a couple years ago. Sexy shirtless picks from Ocon, Gasly, Hamilton, Leclerc and Stroll. Sirotkin or someone taking the piss out of him will make some Russia joke. Soviet Russia, TV watches you. Uh, trust, this is kind of weird. Fist in the air at lap 19 of Mexico. Kimi Raikkonen angry on team radio at some point. Crashes in Monaco and Singapore. At least one race with no DNFs or DNSs. At least one driver disqualified at some point. Hamilton scolded for princess dresses rubbish. Boys don't wear princess dresses. Uh, some not native speaker of Spanish will give some interview in Spanish. At least 10 races will have a first lap drama. One driver will be sent to the back of the grid twice. Max Verstappen will win driver of the day at least once. The highest driver of the day score will not be higher than one third. Esteban Ocon on the podium at some point. Daniel Ricciardo will fart in the middle of an interview. Winner's trophy in Mexico given by Enrique Peña Nieto. No injuries or fatal crashes in any race. And Andres Manuel Lopez Obrador will, for the third time in a row, lose the Mexican general election. So, those are my predictions. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time with another video.